as we prepare to come before our Lord, I invite you to take a deep breath and think about the ways that we can choose that are the better way. Let us come before our Lord in prayer. God of stepfathers and adopted parents, God of angel messengers and newborn kings, we bow our heads today with praise on our lips. For who else but you would pick two ordinary folks to be God's parents? And who else but you would be patient enough to lead Mary and Joseph back to one another? And who else but you would assume the best of fragile human hearts? The answer is no one. For you alone are our God, and in your grace and in your devotion, you open the door for us to see a new day. So today we pray, help us to be like Joseph, who reminds us that grace is within reach. In a word full of competition, help us to choose celebration. In a world full of scarcity, help us to choose abundance. In a world of war and violence, help us to choose peace and grace. In a world divided by lines, of divided lines, help us to choose connection and relationship. In a world of quick assumptions and stereotypes, help us to choose curiosity and compassion. In our Oakville community, open our hearts, open our eyes to see the needs of our neighbors. Open our minds to seek to understand our differences. Open our hearts to reach out in love. Lord God, help us to reach a little deeper into our pockets, helping caring agencies like Kerr Street Ministries the Salvation Army, Evangel Hall, Jane Finch, and so many others. In our churches, may our families draw closer to you and to each other. Reading your word, the teaching we receive through Reverend Jackie, the music we hear, the praises that we sing as we worship you, and the hospitality that we enjoy and the new friends we meet. In our striving to choose a better way, God, may we be transformed. May this story of Joseph rattle something loose in us. May this story of Joseph help us drop the need to be right or to be the best or to have it all figured out. And instead, May it draw us closer to authenticity and you. May this story of imperfection show grace in, so grace into our bones. And may we catch a glimpse of your love in our world. May we shake off the dust of our old selves and live into something new. And may we be a little more like Jesus, like Joseph. But mainly, may we be a little bit more like you. With hope in our hearts, we pray as Jesus taught us to pray. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power and the glory forever and ever. Amen. 